Hello everybody and welcome to the Clubhouse server. Uh, Clubhouse server is for the patrons of Flute Maker and Sten Stone. And this is season four. Now season four's just started. Well it started a few days ago but I've uh, had stuff in real life to deal with. So I'm going to join it for the first time and we're going to talk a little bit about it. We don't have any plans as yet but uh, let's check it out. Wow, just fall down straight in the middle, eh? In the middle of the night. Awesome. Uh, yeah, so this, as I said, is the uh, patron server of Freeze Maker and Sten Stone. Which way do you want to go? Let's pick a direction. Uh, let's go west. Um, and as such, it is a whitelisted server. So uh, details on how to join said server will be in the description below. But um, it's not it's not public, so it's not available to everyone. And I've been invited along for season four, so uh, it's been a while since I've played a bit of vanilla. But uh, as you can see already, we've got this custom tree generation. Um, I don't know if it applies to all trees or just makes the birch ones like this. Um, I kind of want to get away, a little away from spawn. Oh, look at beehive! Uh, before I start breaking anything. Uh, as I said, there's no. Oh, did you see that shot? I saw it. Um, no plans as such. Again, uh, I'm not too sure how frequent I'm going to upload this. Um, I suppose a few of you are probably wondering, has this replaced the British Craft server? Uh, not sure, if I'm honest. Uh, that has come to a bit of a, a grinding, grinding halt, I would say. It's probably a nice way of saying it. It's not very popular at the moment. Uh, my opinion on that is purely the fact that it is uh, Vintage Beefs. Um, server. Look, we're going to have to sort this tree out because that's... I don't know who's done this, but I'm taking this wood. Um, and at the beginning of it, it was very much... Um, he, he was very much active on it. So, in you know, in my eyes, it's... Um, oh, God. It's very... Is that sand? Is that red sand? What's that doing there? Yeah, uh, because he's not so active on it anymore, and, you know, things change people decided not to sort of hang around as much. That's my view anyway. Um, we are currently waiting for season three to kick in. And that'll be essentially when uh, the Never update uh, gets released. This version here is uh, 1.15.2. And uh, we will update on this server to the Never update when it comes out. And there will be a video in the description below of Fluesmaker explaining why that is. Because uh, I can't remember offhand, essentially. Oh, lovely and snowy. Look at this. Let's take some, uh, take some berries, shall we? Because we need some food. And we've just taken some damage. Of course we have. Foxes! Hello, friend! I've never seen a fox before in Minecraft. <laughs> Are you someone as a pet? Because you're sort of sat still there. No idea. What about you? Do you want to love me? Yeah, have some berries. Have one. Have one berry. What the? Was that the fox noise? Because that was terrifying. Sounds like a fox mating call. <laughs> oh, hello. Into the tree line. Probably not the best idea. Look, more custom trees. Spider. Um. Oh, some wolves. Uh, I don't know why we joined on there at night time. Um. Anyway, what I'm gonna do is keep on going for a little bit and try and find a space to call home. Oh no! Actually, I might. I'll keep. I'll keep recording just in case I die because it's gonna happen. That. Um. But uh, yeah, I'll be back with you. Hopefully, no, 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 no. Um, I'll be back with you guys in a little bit. Oh please, I can't run anymore. Did you stop chasing us? Hopefully, you stop chasing us. Just enough wood to uh. Do the bad thing. <laughs> um, this is an example over here of um, a chunk error. I <laughs> don't know what's happened with that generation. Um, as I said earlier, interesting that there's a bit of red sand underneath there. Uh, that could be could be a feature of Optifine. I'm not too sure. Did we get three pieces of beef from that one cow? It's all good. We're going to have to eat raw food, I think. You don't drop anything and you spit at us. We can't afford to take any damage. I'm liking this little area here, but... Uh, how far away from me? A thousand blocks out. We kind of built in a snowy biome before, so we're gonna keep on keep on rolling. 
And uh, looks like the, the moon is finally going down. Don't you chase us. We haven't got any food. We can eat more beef, can't we? Yeah. Shouldn't eat more chicken. You can eat more beef. Ah, so that's how timber works. It just breaks the whole tree. Uh, it looks like because it's attached to other logs. That is, uh, the leaves aren't despawning. Or are they? Maybe it's just despawning slowly. Yeah, I can hear the snow coming off them. There we go. Here it goes. Cool. Um, sheeps. Well, I need some sheeps because I need to, uh, A, get some food, and B, set a spawn when I get somewhere. <laughs> We're still in this snowy biome, which is quite a surprise, actually. Um, I don't know what the generations were on this. Again, uh, hopefully Flues explains it on his video. Um, this is like a little spruce oasis here in the middle of the <laughs> in the middle of the snowy biome here. Uh, I want to say they're large biomes because, uh, yeah, like I say, we've been in a snowy one for quite a while now. Whoa, someone slept and that looks weird. <laughs> My head was sort of twisting to the side then. <laughs> Okay, that's good that um, only sort of one or two people need to sleep for it to be daytime, because uh, I feel you kind of need that on the server. Uh, we're approaching the area I kind of want to settle in, and I don't know that until I see it, but um, what I've decided to do, uh, we're going to set up camp uh, at positive 1983. It's positive because that's the year I was born, and obviously it was awesome. Uh, and negative 2020, because, uh, well, it's been a bit of a rubbish year so far, hasn't it? So we're getting this sort of little plains biome, which is pretty cool. We've got a cavefish nearby, so that's all right. I need to get some stuff in a little bit. So where's the exact spot? It's going to be... Oh, and a river as well. We've gone too far. <laughs> gone far too far. It's going to be this block here. Is where we're calling ourselves home. We're calling ourselves home. This is what we're calling home. And uh, I can't use the buttons on my keyboard. Uh, so yeah. Um, I'm probably going to set up a little dirt house or something here. Um, as I said before. And I'm not too sure how frequent these episodes will be. It'll be sort of. Uh, as and when I feel like it. Because I'm currently enjoying modded. And I do have a lot of time on my hands. Don't have a lot of time on my hands. Is what I meant to say. Um, so yeah. Let's get the building. And I'll be back with you guys in a little bit. Oh, it's just night time already. Why is it always night time already? Uh, what do you want to do with the iron? What do you want to do with the iron? Let's make an axe. Because I... Prefer, actually, and, and a... Um, what's it called? Pick. I prefer... Um, uh, let's take this out. Throw you in there. I prefer this over... Um, armor, to begin with. Because we've got a bit of... Uh, a bit of stuff. Uh, but speaking of stuff, <laughs> uh, I was obviously walking around a little bit, got some coal, some coal? Yeah, got some coal from over here, uh, as well as some other bits. But that thing that we pointed out earlier, that little cave entrance, is actually uh, a tiny little spawn room. So I lit it up, I ran straight past to see how far the cave went down, and that's it, there's a baby zombie nearby, of course there is. Um, so yeah, let's see what we got. Uh, like at the sea and some string. So it looks like we should do a bit of fishing. We can get some beetroot. Name tag, awesome. Um, I think I've got levels to name something. Oh, another name tag, nice one. But uh, haven't got the iron to do so yet. So I'm gonna do a bit of caving. So we've got a saddle and some horse armor. That's always good. Um, actually, I'm gonna use this piece of wheat. He's running for us. You can hear him. Um, what I found over here. On the other side of the bank. Hello, mate. See you later. Bye. Um, get out of my place. Is. Are you still following us? I've lost them already. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Uh, is it. He spawned. No, it's still here. We have found a little pink sheep. <laughs> and these are quite rare, if I remember. So we're going to coerce him over to our place. Come on. Um. So I made a little pen for him, and we're, now we've got a name tag, we can name him. Uh, not too short to name him yet, but I'm sure it'll be something really appropriate. 
Um, then I'm going to dig down and start doing a bit of strip mining. I know it's not the, the best footage, which is why I'm not going to show you it. Um, it's Come on, mate. Come on, you can swim, can't you? There we are. Um, you're suffocating. Please be quiet. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm going to do a little bit of strip mining. There is a mining world, um, as far as I remember, from what I've read. And I think the Never and the End are opening it. They're not opening here, because uh, we're saving it for the Never update. Uh, I'm not too sure about the End, actually. Come on, mate. Look, we're sitting ducks here. Come on, on the side, on the side. We're going to get blown up by a second and by a creeper or something. Come on, just jump on jump on the thing. Uh, yeah, so I want to get him to safety. I'm going to do a bit of strip mining, get some resources. And uh, probably should build a dirt house so we're protected from all this madness around us. Bro, come on. Uh, so be back <laughs> after I've done all that. Hindsight is a wonderful thing, right? Because um, I wish I was recording... That first segment of me mining because I went down to Y0 down here. Y0? Uh, Y12. Right and uh, actually we keep banging our heads, don't we? We just sort this out. Uh, yeah, went down to the Y12. Uh, started making a couple of places to start strip mining. And literally the first one i done on the left-hand side here. I went force. Not even that. And then, um, <laughs> so this is what we're currently rocking. We got the diamond chest plate before we got the iron leggings. So that was a bit weird. Um... And we start digging this way to collect some more resources. I think that little KF, that's some more diamonds in it. So yeah, we've got the pick. Um, we've got the chest plate. And I made an enchanter table. Because we also made some... Uh, well, we found some lapis ready for enchanting. We got enough iron for a an anvil. Uh, what else did we get? We've been ignoring um, a few of the XP-based things like redstone and coal. Purely because, um, well, you die easy, don't you? And that's what happened to me as well. So I got way through to the end here, found like a little cave. I was uh, happy to hear the bat sound after such a long, long track. Actually, what isn't that long? I mean, I think we can just about see the entrance there, maybe. Um, and uh, there was a skeleton in front of me, so I had my shield up, ready to get him. Creeper comes from behind, blows me up. So, uh, Hey, that's always fun, right? And did I bring stuff with me? I thought I did, because I got through this gap here, as I say. Let's make some more of these. That'll do. I can hear the lava to the left there. That's where I got the obsidian and stuff. And there's a bit more of a cave here. There's more cave up here. But what surprised me was uh, the, uh, the shaft entrance. <laughs> and uh, there's a guy nearby. Where is he? Oh, there's a tiny guy nearby as well. Where are you? Okay, I can see uh, a thingy. What's it called? Well, oh, you took some damage. Where'd you fall from, man? Lovely and scared to start with. That's how we. That's how we roll. What's down there? That's lava. So try not to get back pedaled down there. Um. Cool. So hopefully we've got some good things. This looks like one of those horrible entrance things. Ugh. Hear noises everywhere. Um, cool. So yeah, it's going to be a case of um, lighting up and stuff around here. Here an Enderman somewhere. Loads of gold, which is always good. This generation of this, this sort of cave mine looks a bit odd. Hopefully we're quick with this, so... Yeah, yeah, we should be fine. What I just don't want to happen is um, a creeper fall on me. But it's, uh, you know what? Just easy way of doing it, right? Things like that make it <laughs> worthwhile coming in here. Where you at, bro? Yes, it's really multi-level, this mineshaft. They've always been like that, and it's just the cave generation that's thrown me off. Don't know. Um... So let's explore this for a little bit. Do we need gold? I suppose we should be getting everything we can, right? Hello. Bye. Um, you coming for me? Yeah, of course you are. We kind of want a bow, um, so we will get some string. This is what happened last time. I got in a battle with a skeleton like this, and then had a creeper behind me. Do need a bow. Uh, we've got string for it, but we've uh, got the enchantment for a 
fishing rod. So maybe we'll go down that route. Kind of want to avoid sort of AFK farms if I can. Um, especially fish farms because they're quite cheaty, aren't they? I believe actually uh, they are nerfed in 116, so you can't sort of AFK and just get all the good things because. It is a bit sad, isn't it? I mean, I mean, if, if you want to play a game and get certain things a certain way, then that's down to you. But um, for me, you know, I suppose I don't really call myself a content creator as much. But um, it must be boring. If it's boring to watch, then it's sometimes boring to play, in my opinion. So where are we? What are we doing down there? We're getting stuck. We're getting cornered from things and stuff. Who's, calling? Who's having a go? Alright, mate. Come down. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to hopefully... I don't know how you managed to... Oh, you fell damage. <laughs> you fell damage. That's a word. Or oh, it's a combination of words. I don't want to get killed now, do we? Uh, yeah, I'm going to investigate this mine shaft. Uh, there's a creeper boy there. And hopefully there's some more good stuff. But uh, I'm going to do a bit more caving. And then... Uh, I think that's going to be it for this episode. We've... Uh, Got off to a fresh new good start and uh, we were quite lucky with the area we started in actually because uh as i say Ugh. um oh no this is this is what we want to avoid don't we cave spiders especially this early on in the game um yeah we, we were quite fortunate with where we started because um we've got some good diamonds straight away we've got a spawner we've got another spawner through there if we want to um so yeah, like I say, we'll see how frequent this becomes, but uh, I'm not promising anything. It's more to sort of enjoy, enjoy playing. But anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.